My name's Tony, and welcome to Big Daddy's Bear Cave. Hey, so y'all ready for some Tiki DIY? <laughs> I'm so stoked about this. This turned out exactly like I hoped it would. So stay tuned, and I'm gonna show you a little bit of my little adventure here. Okay, so seriously, out of all the places in Florida, this particular home goods and winter, winter garden rocks. <laughs> I might have to buy this, 19.99. Look how cool that is. I seriously would contemplate uh, replacing the clock with a screen. It's super cool. Fish float, $14.99. Not bad. Definitely not bad. Look at all these fish floats. That's so cool. All right, so this is pretty cool too. Uh, $12.99, puffer fish. Looks almost like a tiki mug. Definitely doesn't have a hole other than the bottom, but so cool, I really dig it. Uh, I showed this to my wife, she loved this, but I thought this was pretty, pretty much a pretty cool find. Octopus, and there is a hole, put a tiki drink in it. So cool, $24.99. in home goods in Tampa, Florida. And I'm telling you, I just hit the mother load <laughs> of fish floats. Oh my goodness, take a look at this. Isn't that crazy? So many of them. Wow. So cool. I know, seriously. It's my wife down there, she says it's like tiki heaven for me. <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> Very cool. Seriously, a lot of cool stuff over here. I really dig that cage looking, looking like like a tanner. Now this is one of the benefits of living in Florida. <laughs> wow. Okay, so there's a reason why I'm thinking tiki and skulls. So I recently bought at Home Goods uh, the the mask or the helmet, excuse me, um, the diver helmet. I'm gonna put this bad boy in the diver helmet, and if he doesn't fit, I'm gonna put one of these guys. I'm gonna get some lights and make it into a a skull in the helmet. So yes, Tiki and Halloween are gonna go together. It'll be one thing. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna do. I am really stoked about this. <laughs> Man, I'm almost 40 years old, but I tell you, this kind of stuff just makes me into like a kid. Um, so y'all have seen where I pick this up over at Home Goods. okay? I think this is so cool. I, I, I really want a big one so bad, but I am very happy that it's small because my bar is getting filled up so much <laughs> and i online in uh, all the tiki forums some really cool folks have been putting skulls uh like this guy inside here and uh like the big full-size ones and i had to do the same thing but i wanted to do the small project so this is my first time doing something like this this is either gonna look really cool or really dumb but i don't care i'm gonna do it uh so y'all stay with me and i'll kind of show you the process of what i'm gonna do to make my little tiki uh, skull kind of sunken uh, diver helmet guy. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I thought I'd like to show you some of my progress and I am really, really happy with the results. Not, not done in any way. Um, so let me just kind of tell you what I did. So I took the LED lights And basically, um, I put them on the back of the skull. I used monster um, tape. And this stuff is like a miracle. And it's that white kind of reflective tape. So it could really just kind of get everything out there. I actually drilled a hole on the bottom. I'll put a picture up of that. And I 
basically got the unit and just stuck it down below with some tape and all, and it just, man, it looks so cool. Um, I'm gonna work on the glass for it, and then I'll show you, um, yeah, I'm sure you've seen the beginning of the video, the final results, but I'll give you a big reveal of everything. <laughs> but I'm really excited. This is really cool. Now, one of the hardest things with this was getting that glass put on there. Uh, basically, I had to, what I had to do was recreate kind of a rubber gasket so it could slide right on top. All right, y'all, here is the diver helmet with the skull and the light. And I am super happy with how it came out. How cool is that? <laughs> super stoked. Doing Tiki DIY stuff like this makes my day. I love when you can just like let those creative uh, juices flow. <laughs> I think it's the coolest thing. Making something with your two hands and just uh, getting what you want with those results. So I definitely appreciate you watching. Remember to go ahead and leave a comment below. Let me know if you like this video. That is the best support you can show my channel. And definitely remember to smash that like button. Thanks so much and keep tiki.